What's good, YouTube? Realistic Gaming here. So, some of you guys have asked me to react to Shed 17 and Project G1, which I have reacted to in the past. But I did find this video by Rookie Raceway. He made the Shed 17 and Project G1. He combined the videos into like one video. Huh? So, that's pretty crazy. It sounds intense. So, I said, why not? Let's react to it. It's best of both worlds. All right, here we go. Oh, Soto Ryan. And it's been a long time since I reacted to Shed 17 and Project G1. The truth behind Thomas and his friends was no children's fantasy. The truth would be horrifying. It is 1945 and the remote island of Sodor off the northwest coast of England has emerged from the fog of World War II. The island served as a detention camp for Germans living in England. That's how Professor came to be here. Professor Wilhelm Goethe was born in 1903 in Munich, Germany. His work with genetics and DNA was truly pioneering. Baby Thomas was born in 1968. Oh, baby Thomas. Come on, we're gonna be late. It's the time. Thomas, get moving. 11.45's coming for you soon. He won't wait for us. He must be late again. Thomas, come on. <laughs> Hey, are you alright, Keith? <laughs> that was the loudest throw up. <laughs> the pressure caused by the engine could oh. rupture his organs from the inside. Well, for f had everything recorded. Beep, beep. Thank you. And took the only course he thought he could take. Please. Yo, okay, so it's like literally a speed run. Oh, yeah. The smoke could be seen all morning. Oh. Thomas, man. Yeah. Yo. All right, so now we're on to project here. <laughs> Himself. on national television i am totally to blame for what happened to thomas and all his friends and i do it again tomorrow oh when they battle each other <laughs> this is an epic scene but then like he literally gets beat up at the end kind of sad Damn, you took him to Pound Town. <laughs> this feels like a nightmare. The soldiers' faces will be covered up. <laughs> Even experimenting with mirrors. As well as mirror testing. James's driver Dude, those fire tests that we never experiment on them was crazy. No one but Diesel. What's wrong? What's the matter? No, What's happening? Diesel. I mean, stay with me. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, we ain't got to do 
pretty much anything we want to. Uh, yeah, yeah, but there's bricks up. Yeah, yeah. Going to get up in the morning. Oh. What are you looking at me for? Uh, that's right. Don't worry, all I need is a good watchdog. And on a large supply of coke. Ah! Yo! No! No! Oh! 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 I remember when I first watched this, I was like, my mind was blown. Gordon's alive! Thomas. Thomas, my boy. Oh yeah. So sad, bro. He watched his homeboy die. This was the military's plan all along. No. Thomas decided to leave. Gordon. He'd seen everything. Get your revenge, Thomas. Rip him in half, Thomas. Thomas is a beast. That will not be necessary. Oh, now the professor. Is this, man? What's he doing here? this man is in you, you, our you, care. You have no right to be here. Relax, Mr. Hartley. You are in our capable hands now. Oh. Well, Mr. Hartley. Yo! Everybody got to turn into a train. Oh, yo, that was insane. That's like the most action packed Thomas video I've ever seen in my life. I mean, it was pretty brilliant that he, like, decided to take both Project G1 and, um, Shed 17 and combine them together. He created like this crazy action-packed storyline. It was intense. I'll link the channel and the video down below in the description so you guys can check it out for yourselves. And yeah, thank you all for watching. And let me know what you thought of this video. It was freaking insane, right? Peace.